Hi, this is Dave Chenault with Skylight Systems, and I'm going to show you a quick tour of the integration that we have built between our solution, which is Sidekick 365 DCM, a new app for the Office Store in SharePoint, and Microsoft Word, PowerPoint, and Excel. Just by a quick review, Sidekick 365 DCM is a case management system that's used to manage documents and tasks around a particular case file. It can be used for a lot of different things. In this instance, we're going to show an example using it for managing loan files. Let's open up a loan file. And you can take a quick look to see that there's five documents and no tasks with this particular loan for Stanley Smith at $235,000. And here's a quick list of the first three. If I want to see all of them, I just click on the Documents tab, and there they are. So what I want to do is go ahead and put in some information now into Sidekick 365. And I'm going to go into Word to do that. So let's pop into Word now, and I'll show you the way that I can save information into Sidekick. The first thing you'll notice, this is just a regular Word file, and there's a tab on the top called Add-ins. I'm going to go ahead and select that, and then select the Upload button. This is our Add-in for Word. And you'll see that I have a lot of options here. I can find a particular loan or I could make a new case, or I could then upload a document to an existing case. Let's go ahead and make a new one. I'm going to call this one Loan 2299. And it's going to have a case number, in this case, of 2299. And I'll go back and just say this is for Williams. It was created today. And a short description, I'll just say it's 343K, um, and leave it at that. So now I've got this new loan, and I want to upload the document into that loan file. So all I do is just select it and say Upload. And now I can give it a name, and I can give it a category. And this list of uh, category options, these document types, are actually picked right out of SharePoint. And I can add new ones here as well. But let's go ahead and just make it a background letter. And I was OK with that title. And now we'll see that that Word file has been uploaded, and let's look at the cases and take a look at it. So we should see that 2299 Williams loan on the top, and let's go take a look at it. And we'll see that letter right there, and I can open it up in uh, the Office Word web app, which is great. And I can now view it or edit it online, etc. Now let's take a look at Microsoft Excel and see how that works. So I'll come on back here to Excel. And this is the amortization schedule. I'm going to upload that one into the loan file I just created, which was for Williams. And this is pretty simple. I'll just leave it at Worksheet. And this time I'll pick a different category. I'll say it's a requirement and say OK. And the same way, it'll upload that file from my desktop right up into Office 365. Now the interesting thing is, is we're equally happy to run in Office 365 or on-premise. So if you have SharePoint 2013 installed on your site, then you can go ahead and install our um, solution as well as these add-ins. But if you have it in the cloud, we're also happy to work there. So you can see now we have two documents. We have our amortization and our pre-approval letter. Let's finish up with PowerPoint, um, and we'll show a little uh, different slice on things here as well. So I'm going to select PowerPoint, and now I'm going to select the add-in. But this time, it's the first time I've uh, selected PowerPoint. I've never logged into the solution. So now I'm going to be presented with a screen that will challenge me for my credentials. So I'll go ahead and do that. And I'm just typing them in. And then I can say, keep me signed in so I don't get challenged each time that I do this. But I wanted to show what it's like to log in in real time to Office 365 with our solution running and get an idea of the speed. And what you'll see is it's very fast. So let's go ahead and put this PowerPoint up in this brand new case file, this Loan 2299 that I made. And I'm fine with the name. It's fine. And we'll take a final look at that file up on the web. And it's a little bigger, so it took just a few more moments. And let's go take a look. So if I refresh this page, I should see three documents listed now. And I do. And my PowerPoint is right there. Now the last thing I'll show you is the integration we have with Outlook. This is also powerful. So I have an email that I sent from my Gmail account into my Outlook account. 
and I have the fact that Lonnie Johnson was approved. So I'm going to go ahead and send this email into Sidekick, and I'll put that into the Johnson file. Actually, I'll throw that in the brand new one I made just to show it a little different. But I can make a new case here too, or upload to any of the files. And it's just the same type of idea. Now when I come over to that file, uh, I'm going to say no here. Let me go back over to that file. And I'll look at the documents. I'm in the case. Now I can see that email. So I have a Word document. I have a um, uh, an email, a PowerPoint, and Excel. And let's take a look real quick. So if we look at the Lonnie Johnson, this is what's really great about the new version of SharePoint 2013. It'll open up the Outlook email message right in Outlook for me, which is great. And now I can do things like forward it, send it on, etc. So that's just a quick update. I wanted to go over the integration we have with uh, Sidekick 365, DCM, and Office. And that's with Word, PowerPoint, Excel, and Outlook. Thanks again. If you have any questions, email us at info at skylightsystems.com.